11 now, it's the holiday gift an East Bay family wasn't sure they'd receive for at least another decade. An Oakland nurse who made national headlines after she was deported to Mexico last year is back home with her family tonight. ABC 7 News reporter Jovina Fortson was at SFO for the emotional reunion. <laughs> when you think about a holiday welcome home, a couple pictures at the airport will usually mark the moment just fine. But tonight, Maria Mendoza Sanchez gets a full press conference. There were many days I was ready to give up. Sanchez and her husband were deported to Mexico last year, leaving their children behind in Oakland. At the time, I said that the courts consistently held that neither Sanchez or her husband had a legal basis to stay in the U.S. The couple had been in the country for more than two decades. Sanchez got a bachelor's degree, was working as an oncology nurse in Highland Hospital, and paying taxes too. Her American dream was thrown off the rails 15 months ago, despite the efforts of members of Congress and colleagues. When I graduated and they were there. All my life, my mom supported me and took care of me and I was going to make damn sure that I took care of her kids while she wasn't here. An employment-based visa, H-1B, with Sanchez's ticket home. Alameda Health System sponsored it. Her visa was selected in a lottery. Her husband wasn't eligible. I was trying to go to Canada and I said like, I haven't done anything. There has to be a way. There has to be a waiver. There has to be something for somebody like me. Her story has become a face case for national immigration issues. Despite Trump's unfair, inhumane, cruel separation of this beautiful family, Maria didn't give up. And will be spending the holidays with her children. Reporting in San Francisco, Jobina Fordson, ABC 7 News. New video.